10, ten swings, swings and try to hit 69. First, uh, most 69s. That's right. Wins. Okay, Tosh and I are off to Harbor Freight to get some, I think they're called snatch blocks, and uh, a mount for this radar gun here to go on the wall so it doesn't get smacked in live ABs. Okay, so we got this little here bracket uh, that we're gonna put in the wall, and then the radar gun just gonna sit in it. Of course they need the radar gun the like hour that we steal it. Okay, so Sarah's here today and we're gonna get all of these boxes <clears throat> unboxed and set up some furniture around the house because <laughs> I have zero furniture. I don't have a couch. I don't even have a stool. I'm sitting on this ladder if I want to eat. Next up on the agenda is construction stuff. What do we have, uh, what do we got going on over here? We're building a sauna if you'd like to step inside it. Is it hot? Uh, you tell us. Let's see. It's quite warm in here. There's no roof. <laughs> you think Warren Bauer is gonna be proud of this? Because <laughs> it's smarter and it's safer. We paid a little bit more and we're gonna be using electricity and not manpower. He's gonna hate it. He's gonna hate it. <laughs> so we're up here on the roof and Sim is editing videos. He's just over there watching videos of himself get dominated in live at bats. <laughs> Jigglypuff dominates T-Rex in live ABs. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna play Dizzy Bat Tic-Tac-Toe, team version. So we're gonna have this nine pocket over here and you're gonna dizzy bat over here. You're gonna spin around and get all dizzy and you're gonna run to a line and throw a ball into the nine pocket and then we'll play tic-tac-toe that way. And we're gonna see how that goes. It seems like, it seems very uh, haphazard. I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> we got ice cold soda pop. Uh, spin again, Lego pain harmonica, uh, bizarre food bugs, ice bath pain harmonica, hot chip. Yeah, we got some, uh, we got some serious punishments here. Uh, team Tosh versus Team Trevor. Uh, team Trevor's gonna win, obviously. Let's get it, let's get it. <laughs> what are we doing, dude? It's only 59. Uh, X is uh, sufficiently closed this off, so that's a tie. That's a tie. All right, let's go, let's go. Come on, get up. No. We're gonna get you up. Why? We're gonna get you up. Come on, we're gonna get you up. My team doesn't fail like this. Come on. Well, you haven't failed, we won. We gotta, we gotta win or tie game three, that's all. We just need to play this one to a tie. That's a walk-off win for your boy. If the opposition quit. We have uh, hanging on the wall back here on the net. We have laying down on the job, Tim. Kev, uh, Kev appears to be doing his job, but he, he rested the entire second and third game. What do you think about this, uh, this sound, Kev? What do you think about that sound? Lego paint harmonica. That sounds pretty good right now, doesn't it? Chip, 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 chip. Velo slap pain harmonica. Fuck it, I'll just take it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> show, them, show, them the, show them the hands. Oh, yeah. You can, oh, it's fingers. coming up. It's coming. <laughs> okay, so today we got a max effort, lift, max day. So 
squat, deadlift, press and pull. A little post-activation potentiation. Jigglypuff vs. T-Rex and Live ABs today, let's go! <laughs> Was that a Halloween costume? Yeah. Tell me you went trick-or-treating in that. I did, yes. Yeah. That's sick. You and Rachel get along well. She goes trick-or-treating every single year. She dresses up in a onesie as like a Monsters, Inc. Uh, character and no one ever questions her. I definitely am going to be wearing a helmet, but at the same time it's just like, it's so hard to see. So even if you were to try to if you're throwing like legitimately, there's no way like I could see it at all. You have more of a chance of getting a hit in that with me throwing full speed than Sim does. Probably, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so Eric, Sim, and I are about to take part in the 69 or die challenge part two, hitting edition. Uh, but before we do that, I wanted to ask you, the viewers, what does the Bauer Outage brand mean to you? Uh, what does it make you feel when you wear it? And what, is it, what does the brand mean to you? I'd like to know. So leave me a comment down below and I will be giving away one of these headbands to one of you who comments down below. Uh, give me your explanations. I wanna, I wanna hear your thoughts. Um, wanna know what the, what the people feel when they put on the B and one of you who comments will get a free headband. So let me know in the comments and I'm gonna go beat Erickson in the 69 or die hitting challenge. It literally has 69 on my fucking bat, all right? This, that's what the bat is for, to hit 69, all right? 69 so is like, down. 69 is about 40. Right? Yeah, it's about 40 miles an hour faster than your average exit below <laughs> against me. So uh, you're screwed. Ten, 10 swings, swings and try to hit 69. First, uh, most 69s. That's right. Wins. Yeah, what you got? Fuck! <laughs> oh! Oh! Fuck! That was close. 62. Oh my God! You're screwed. It's a W for your boy. Straight domination, three nothing, shut out. Ah. Yep, spider tack right there. I'm gonna put that on the hand, on the basketball, palm that thing, and just destroy him. Just destroy him. That's what the winner does. To the winner goes the spoils. The to the winner goes the spoils. I even get this open. Tosh. All right, since you got no hops, how much lower? Oh yeah. Oh, we got it. Let's go, baby. All right. No hops. How much lower? Eyes are closed though. Oh! I don't like that one. <laughs> That's a great one. I love it. All right, it's time to line it up for live ABs. I'm gonna get the Jigglypuff hat. I can't wait. Keys to warming up when you're dressed as Jigglypuff, you can't pull fat. So just send it. Ah! Say again. <laughs> we have a T-Rex. Yes! Yes! What are we doing? T-Rex lifts small and bunts the ball. You okay in there? You, are you okay? Do they have Pac-Man here? Did you see they have Pac-Man? Yeah. They do? Let's go, where? I love Pac-Man. This is just when like, we would go to like the fair and we would be all sad because we didn't win anything. My dad would go, all right, go play this and win. We're about to see if your genetics, if you got your dad's whack-a-mole genetics. Last ball. Yeah. Oh! Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> it's actually rigged. 
That was close though. High five. I'm today his assistant. Welcome to my channel or Trevor's channel. I followed you and then I was like, wait, no, he's in a competition with him. I gotta unfollow, so. That's fucked up, that's fucked up. I'm in this challenge, you know the challenge, right? Trevor to have more followers than me, yeah. it's just not gonna I happen. Know. I'm all about command now, dude. I throw all strikes today. <laughs> that, was, that, was that was not it. Okay, so this is the uh, air hockey battle of vloggers. Yeah, buddy! What, uh, do we keep going or what? We played a seven, my guy. Okay, so today is my birthday, and let's go see what I get up to on my birthday. We're gonna start it off with some daily measurements. Grip strength, external rotation. Starts off just like any other day. We'll see what I get into. Okay, so next up in the birthday celebration is a change up pitch design command session ish. Happy MOK day, everybody. This is not about you. <laughs> this is not about you, sir. That's right, that's right. Happy MLK day, everybody. Uh, back to what I was saying, uh, I'm gonna throw, I was strong last night and made some discoveries on my change up. So we're gonna see if I can repeat that tonight. It was good last night at like 70 miles an hour, so we'll see if it can be good today at like 75 or 80 miles an hour. Okay, so next up on the birthday docket, uh, I got my workout and everything in, and I'm off to get a birthday dinner. Now, I have been on my meal plan very consistently, feel a little bit bad going off of it, uh, but I'm gonna get some sushi. So it's not like I'm having terrible cheap meal, I guess. I don't know. I feel a little guilty, but it is my birthday, so I'm trying to celebrate a little bit. But yeah, we're gonna get some sushi and uh, yeah, try out Nobu. Never been there before. So I hear about it in all these rap songs, but uh, never been. So we'll see what it's like. Well, my honest review of Nobu, delicious. Um, they do a great job there. Everything we had was really, really good. Uh, the rap song that says, I just ran the tab up at Nobu, whatever that is. Uh, <laughs> definitely accurate, not hard to do. Uh, quite expensive, but for a birthday dinner once a year, uh, definitely worth it, definitely worth it. It was delicious. Next little birthday present for myself, even though it's the next day, and I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be able to show you guys of this since I'm just one person and I can't really carry the camera and race, but we're going back to the track for another track day. Okay, so we're about to go on a uh, on a track walk, track drive, so the all the cars are gonna follow the uh, lead car. Stop, hop out, talk about the corners, learn the track a little bit. So last time I did a track day, we were at a place called Radford today. We are at a place called Apex Motor Club. It's a new kind of private uh, motor club here in Arizona, way out in the middle of the desert. Nothing really around, which is great. Uh, so this should be fun. It gets really, really good reviews. So I'm excited. Awesome track, awesome people, 
had a really good time, lots of really good conversations. I know nothing about racing. I know nothing about driving fast in this car, so I'm just trying to pick up everything I can from people, but uh, yeah, good day.